Hello, I am Teresa Wilson, City Manager for the City of Columbia. It brings me great pleasure and gratitude to welcome you to the celebration of two significant milestones, National Community Development Week and the 50th anniversary of the Community Development Block Grant Program, fondly known as CDBG. Today, we gather to honor the visionaries and change makers whose tireless efforts have propelled us forward over the past half century and to appreciate the remarkable progress we've made in community development. For five decades, the Community Development Block Grant Program has been a beacon of hope and opportunity for communities nationwide, fostering economic growth expanding access to affordable housing, and strengthening vital infrastructure. It has empowered individuals and communities to shape their destinies, dream bigger, and build brighter futures for themselves and future generations. This week, as we celebrate the transformative power of community development, let us also take a moment to reflect on its profound impact on countless lives. From revitalized neighborhoods, to thriving small businesses, from improved public services to enhanced quality of life. The ripple effects of our collective efforts are felt far and wide. I express my deepest gratitude to every one of you for your unwavering dedication to the cause of community development. Whether you're a government official, a community organizer, a nonprofit leader, or a concerned citizen, your contributions are invaluable and your commitment is truly inspiring. So let us celebrate this momentous occasion with pride and gratitude, knowing that together we can shape a brighter future for all. Happy National Community Development Week, and here's to the next 50 years of building stronger, more resilient communities. Thank you. Good evening, everyone. My name is Felicia Kilgore. I'm the Director of Community Development. I'd like to extend a warm welcome to all of you who have joined us to celebrate this year's National Community Development Week and the 50th anniversary of the Community Development Block Grant Program. We're excited to showcase various initiatives and activities that has been supported by the Home Investment Partnership and more importantly, the Community Development Block Grant Funds. As we commemorate its 50th anniversary, as we all know that the overall welfare of the Columbia communities and the standard of living for our residents rely heavily on these federal government funds. My experience um, with community development was amazing. Um, from the beginning to the end, Ms. Dolores, uh, she told me what I needed to do, all the steps. The process went quickly. It was truly a blessing because I had went through so many challenges uh, trying to actually get a property. Um, and then last year, finding this home and it actually going through, it was truly a blessing. Don't wait, reach out now because it may be steps that you need to take before you're able to purchase that house. But if you stick with community development, they'll make sure you get that dream home. I had my bathroom um, done, like the tub and the bathroom floor. And I had lead in the house, so they had to do, um, remove the lid. I had the kitchen floor done. A few other things, um, the molding around the, um, the bedrooms. If I could use it again, I, I sure would. Anybody that's on the SHINE program, they'll be pleased. In 2016, we created a master plan for T.S. Martin Park. That plan gave us a long-term vision to be implemented in phases as funding became available. Lucky for us, the Community Development Block Grant provided that funding, and it has been really great to see this project come together in multiple phases. Um, as, a, as a total, the park improvements include a new playground, a basketball area, multiple shade structures, walk-and-path loop, softball field improvements, 
site amenities, and perimeter fencing in select areas. Without the support provided by the Community Development Plot Grant, we would not have been able to implement the master plan as quickly as we have. The community has really embraced the improvements here at T.S. Martin Park. The children love the playground and basketball tree, which is a little unique. The adults love the walking path loop, and the softball fields continue to be highly utilized. This investment of approximately 800,000 has also sparked a public-private partnership, as we have a community garden currently in the works. This project in all is a great example of how much impact the Community Development Block Grant can have for a community park. These are just a few of the numerous initiatives and programs that HUD's CDBG and home programs have made available to you. The Community Development Block Grant is one of the longest running programs in the United States Department of Housing, Urban and Development, which funds local community development activities to provide affordable housing, anti-poverty programs, and infrastructure development. I want to thank HUD on behalf of the Community Development Department of the City of Columbia and our partners for their dedication, hard work, and enhancing the quality of life for our residents. Additionally, I express my gratitude to the members of Congress for their ongoing support, which has enabled us to continue improving the lives of our residents in the City of Columbia. Join us in celebrating the 50th anniversary of the Community Development Block Grant Program.